Howdy folks, welcome back. Yes, it's be Battlefield 4, it's on the test range, and I've managed to solve my issue in why I couldn't record it. It's quite, it was quite simple. So at the present time, I am messing around and trying to make sure it is working, and also to let you know that I'm not in work at the moment. I'm meant to be in work tonight, and I'm also meant to be working tomorrow night. However, I am unable to due to the fact is uh, what you don't realize is the la in the last two and a half months I've been suffering with a, a particularly nasty chest. For some reason it goes tight. When it goes tight, I start coughing. And what I hadn't realized is every time I was doing that, it was putting pressure on the rest of the muscles, you know, the abdominal muscles, and also my middle and lower back. However, last night when I was working, my lower back gave out me. And I woke up today, felt perfectly fine, and then suddenly, went, as I went to work, got off the bus. And I almost collapsed because my back had just went. So I went to the hospital and literally, he's literally told me that I can't do any heavy lifting for the next couple of days. And he's also given, also given me some diazepam, which is a muscle, a muscle relaxant to help me get my muscle to recover. So hopefully I'm back in work by next Thursday. Uh, but I'm going to have to ring him up later on and let him know I won't be in for Saturday night shift. So. Get back and I'll say, oh, do you like my mad skills in flying? I, the reason why I go on test range is because I always go and practice on the flying part. I'm, I'm trying to get the flying part down to a T. Jet, I'm not even bothering because the jet I always seem to crash. But the helicopter, I'm trying to get down to a T. So, as the Blues and Twos will tell you, I'm not the best uh, helicopter pilot, but I, I do have some pretty good, <laughs> uh, good moments every now and then. I get away from aircraft and, you know. And as you saw in some of the videos, I do pretty well. So, getting back to the problem. As you will see towards the end of this video, you will see exactly what I'm using. However, but I will just explain, I am using the operating system Windows 10, as you already know. However, the drivers, well, the AMD drivers, they've got two release copies. One is the Windows 7 and the Windows 8 edition, and you've also got the Windows 10 edition. Uh, the Windows 8 and 7 edition still supports Mantle, so therefore the Raptor software which records your gameplays still recognizes Mantle. However, the Windows 10 doesn't because Windows 10 supports um, DirectX 12 and DirectX 11 3D. Uh, you might notice it, it every now and then it'll jerk slightly because I'm on ultra settings and because I'm using. Uh, DirectX 11 3D, I'm going to have to drop some of the settings so I get a constant frame rate because with DirectX it will drop and will give you a slight lag and that's what's happening. However, when you're recording, you don't have none of the, uh, as you can see, tearing. But when I was playing, I was getting the tearing, but when I'm recording, I don't seem to be getting the tear, which is not that bad. So that's what was the problem was, I couldn't play, uh, record it because I was using Mantle because Windows 10 doesn't, uh, the Windows 10 drivers for AMD does not uh, support it for recording. You can play, don't get me wrong, you can play it at Mantle but you cannot record which is really, really strange and I don't understand why they did it. It was, hopefully they're going to patch that because at the end of the day Mantle was their baby and they were playing Battlefield 4, you want the best frame rate possible and Mantle is the best frame rate. Unless the uh, Battlefield 4 decides to, how can we say, uh, implement uh, DirectX 12, if, if they do that, then it doesn't matter because DirectX 12 I would be having the same frame rate, same possible outcome as I would be having if I was working on uh, Mantle. So you never know, it might, Battlefield 4 might support it. Uh, Battlefield well, Battlefront Star Wars, I believe it is going to support uh, DirectX 12, so that's going to be quite interesting. It's going to be fun. Right, oh, look at that. I landed back in, in the exact same spot where it took off. That's not too bad. <laughs> yeah, that's the sky. I love this gun. I need to uh, unlock some uh, attachments so I'll get to start playing that one. I feel a little bit better. At the moment, I'm not playing on the PC because I'm just relaxing and doing this commentary and watching they're not going to watch a bit of TV because I can't really do it so here's the options in here's the graphics I've had to do the direct 3d 11 
Ah, uh, that's the only one I can use. If I use Mantle, recording the capture device won't work unless I start off with 3D, then swap over the Mantle, play, record, and then swap back. But the reason why it wasn't working for me is quite simple. When I was trying on the 3D, I wasn't reset, wasn't resetting the PC. I needed to reset the PC, and that was my mistake right along. I was doing half it right with swapping to 3D uh, DirectX 11 version, but I wasn't turning up the PC because I, I was ready on Mantle, the Rapture software thought I was still on Mantle, so I needed to do what I did. It's quite simply, I swapped to DirectX, uh, Direct 3D 11, I then completely and utterly closed the game, then I restarted the PC, and then when I came back on, I just returned back to V4, went to the test range, and Bob's your uncle, my recording little logo appeared. And that's, it was that simple. I spent the uh, three or four days contacting Raptor and uh, AMD and, and I had no joy in front of them and then I solved it myself. <laughs> How really, really strange is that? But as you can see, I'm not a bad pilot. I'm not the best pilot because it is, I can tell you, what I've seen on the game so far, there are some really, really fantastic pilots out there. However, I know, I, I'll say I'm not too bad. I'll say I'm a fair pilot. Not bad. And you see, landing there. <laughs> so, I hope you liked this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up and a like. Uh, don't forget to check Tango Alpha's channel because we do have a dual commentary in that game because we did record game was a bit of half an hour long. I hope you enjoy it on Metro. But until next time, it's me, Will, signing off and I will be uploading some Battlefield 4 gameplay soon. Bye!